Man, you come straight out of a cone. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of Straight Out of a Comic Book. Ladies and gentlemen, we have always had the theory of that. Um, if you've seen uh, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, that characters seem like they could possibly be actors. We, I have decided to come with some of our favorite Disney characters and have us figure out what do they do after they yell cut on some of these iconic movies and shows that we have seen them in. And with the help of Mastermind Connects, we are using some of his phenomenal artwork mm-hmm. today to show mm-hmm. and, and discuss these. So it is time to move into the next uh, portion of this. Yay. Um, Roxy, contain yourself. Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. We don't need you on a 15 minute mm-hmm. tangent of what you'll do to him. Keep this peace. Wait, where's, where's Kovu? Where is the Kovu drive? Where, you ain't put that in there? No, no, I didn't put that in. Oof. Well, no. mm, okay. Marco, sorry. When you dropped the oh, no, let me calm. Let me bro. calm down. Oh, wait. <laughs> I was like, no. That, that was on purpose. That on. was on purpose. <laughs> that was on purpose. Got turned on. Let's give, let's give Roxy a second. Let's see. He's so fine. <laughs> sorry. Hold on. <laughs> Let me just y'all y'all start talking. What? Like, With the lollipop? <laughs> <laughs> what? No. And she rolled off the screen. <laughs> oh. You know about to you don't see he he packing, both of them packing. Oh, oh my god. god. Man. Why you turn my camera off? They can still hear me. Stop. Ma'am, you are Why you turn my camera off? Ma'am. This is <laughs> You brought me here. You knew what this was. Yes, I did know what this was. And I also know that you could keep it. Put the lollipop down. <laughs> Get the lollipop out your mouth while you're looking at Mufasa. Okay, no, I won't. Okay, I'm not going to make it sexual. This is just really good. Oh, my God. Marco, you single-handedly were able to turn incredible legendary <laughs> characters into, as we see with Roxy's... Uh, <laughs> Showing it off to Ufasa and Simba. <laughs> Bro, you nailed this. No. Did you ever expect Marco for it to Welcome take Welcome back. <laughs> Not at all. Sly, can you hear Thank you. I Hi, can Sly. Yes. I Sly, had to, what's up? What's up? Had to Is... restart my computer and like punch a couple pillows, do my kid boo screen <laughs> that I do when I get frustrated. I'm good. I... Welcome back. Welcome back. Well, you did unfortunately miss a, a, goofy, uh, a goofy movie, but to catch you up, uh, Max is following in the footsteps of his father. Got his own little goof troop in suburbia. Uh, Roxanne is pansexual. That's is that the phrase? Mm-hmm. Pansexual uh, with a traveling blog, eating sushi in Thailand. I can see it. I can and see And then uh, Powerline. Powerline is, is kind of like Cleo, adapted to the times after there was a vicious murder. Uh, at the power line concert, vicious. thanks to you and the security Goofy guard got electrocuted. Yeah, Max got a record for that. See, I was I was tracking until yeah. we got to that part. I was like, okay, he got it close because he was a minor. I can yeah. see. Goofy got put on house arrest because basically that was attempted murder because he wasn't even supposed to be. He got attempted murder, trespass, and assault. Stalking. He, he got a whole bunch of crimes. I left for fifteen minutes. <laughs> <laughs> a lot has happened. Like, damn. <laughs> Hey. You gotta, gotta go to college, Max. Right. <laughs> 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 I was literally practicing it all day. And then we found Pretty out small. that Roxy's into furries, you know. Ooh. Oh, yeah. So, um, yes. Thanks to Marco, you've turned wise dad father like Mufasa, who you just go for the <laughs> wisdom and hope for the future into. <laughs> Um, to the base, sit on the face, zaddy like ah! creep person. Mm-mm. And then you guys, you got Simba following in his footsteps. You, you just pr- pretty much turned them <laughs> into the new black excellence. Like, what was your inspiration Tell me. Tell me. behind this? Yes. Okay, so, <clears throat> so I drew Scar first, mm-hmm. and then. I saw I saw the thirst come out of nowhere. I was very shocked because I didn't do it on purpose. But then I decided uh, since 
Mufasa is like the opposite of Scar. I was like, all right, let me, let me, let me see if I wasn't just like a one-off. Let's see if, let's see if I'm doing this on purpose. I, I drew Mufasa the way he was, like I kind of based him on the rock. Mm. Um, and uh, it happened again, and I was like, okay, wait, 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 wait. So then I did R- Rafiki, mm-hmm. and I'm like, all right. And then I was still receiving thirst, and I was like, that's not even the heavy hitter. And then I drew Kovu, and I already knew. I already knew it was going to happen with Kovu, and then it worked. And I was like, all right, y'all thirsty out here. <laughs> they hella thirsty out here, bro. Like, e- e- y'all even, thirsty? Like, you, but even, you, but you, even the way I drew, even the way I drew the, the lionesses or anything, not near the amount of thirst that the guys got at all. No. Not nearly. I see Nala there, and I love the fact that you included the uh, I believe the Beyonce Adidas line had just debuted around that same time. Oh, yeah. But the fact that you made sure to put Nala in that fit, I was like, that's dope. That is fire. But no one really mentions the details as far as her purse, which I believe is Zazu's feathers. Yeah, it's fire. Oh, fire. Yep. Oh, oh, and then, you, then you got Sir- Oh, good. We didn't we didn't thirst over the ladies like that, but when I tell you the amount of thirst that came out for wow. Mufasa, Simba, and Kovu, I was like, yo, y'all would have brought <laughs> these dudes if they wasn't real. Yo, life. what? They was like, bro, they were on <laughs> it, man. Like, cause you you drew them like they oh they know they own Pride Rock. Like if somebody owned Pride Rock, this is what they draw. Like Sarabi so looked like, yeah, you know, you know what I run. You know what I'm rocking over here. Mufasa is like, Mufasa is like, yo, I'm good. I've gone through the struggle. I like he used to look like he gang bang and then like drop hella bodies. <laughs> yes. And yes. I'm and then you, you got young Simba out here, <clears throat> ain't really had to go through much and stuff like that, but still like the cat to not mess with. He the socialite and stuff with Nala on his arm and shit, just ready to take over the world. Probably got a water company like Jaden. Oh, I can see that. <laughs> so who do y'all want to start up? No matter of fact, no, because I know who Roxy gonna say. I'm okay. not. I'm not gonna. I'm gonna just let y'all go first. I'm not gonna say anything to the end because. So let let she, she brought a fan out. Right. <laughs> she got hot. You gonna start doing sermons just, and hymns? I just made it because yeah, I was getting. Now, as far as I'm concerned, I will say, out of all the Disney characters, I kind of feel like these people stayed together. Like this, this was like the real reg- a legit relationship between Nala, Simba, Sarabi, and uh, Mufasa. Like they still together, still rocking. <laughs> I think Nala probably got like wait, wait, she already had a kid, right? Uh, Simba and, and Nala. Yeah, yeah, they had a yeah. daughter. Yeah, he, she married Kobe. Probably got another one on the way. You know what I'm saying? No, this is for sure the royal family of Pride Rock. And uh, we would hope that no issues would ever come between them all to break that up. No, you know, Simba's having to try to check his father in any type of way. I don't think that's a, a battle he but would he win did. anyway. He did. He did. Well, we w- are we going to believe that Simba, that, that Mufasa's dead? Mufasa's nah, dead. man, I, I, I just thought he got real hurt. I think that was it, man. And then but he wasn't uh, in the second one. Nah, man, because Sarabi was over there patching him up, you know, licking his wounds, making sure he's good <laughs> and stuff like that, you know? It took him a while to come back. Mm-hmm. Man, I can't, can't keep dealing with these rock streets, you know what you I'm talking. saying, man? I like this. It's too much pride on the line. So, you know. <laughs> well, but if he's not dead, nah, I think, I think, man, you know, he still got that wisdom. Like, I think Simba really, like, looked up respecting his father. Like, I don't think, I think he, May have checked him once. He had to like let him know still, like, yo, don't let the gray streak fool you. I still, I'm still the pride of the rock, and they good. Yeah. I'm, I will hope so, man. I will hope so. I don't know. Go ahead, Roxy. Fire off. I didn't want to interrupt. No, go for I it. do not think that Simba and Nala stay together. Because, okay, because I was analyzing all of this earlier. I They never were really romantically interested in each other. The bulk of the relationship was platonic. The bulk of it was platonic until they had sex in front of Timon and Pumbaa. I think the reason that they liked each other was because, you know, they they had the friendship, but I didn't really see them looking romantically interested in each other. First like the whole all, movie. You are telling hella lies. When? 
When other than the sex scene? Hold on, hold on. First, first of all, they didn't have sex in front of Simone and Pumbaa. Yeah, Simone they did. and Pumbaa went look like perverts. So there's a difference, okay? They went they and watched them have on. sex. They knew. Okay. Secondly, you saw the look, okay? You saw the look. We it was the look of I want penis, but not necessarily Simba's penis. I want the penis that is she on me right now. She almost died for this dude. She, went she across, loved him platonically. She went across the desert to find. Then why did she sleep with him? Why is she still? So they can't because she, she cared about Pride Rock and she why? wanted to continue the legacy, not necessarily because she was in love with so Simba. Why and he's with fucking all the other lionesses because why she have, wanted because she loved Pride Rock. So she, she had a kid with him because she the loved bear oh, air. So, the dick so was okay, already right? in her. That's why so, she looking like that. I'm starting to think Roxy's a hater of this young love. No, That's what's I love to ask. <laughs> you want to break up happy homes? Look at that. That ain't nothing platonic. The dick right was there. already in her. Yeah. Of no, course, she's looking like that. No, yeah, she was, was on top of her. They was, no, they was rolling down the deal. Nah, bro. The dick was Roxy, already in. Roxy, I'm not trying to cut you off now. But no, it was not. Because think it, that, cam that camera went from her face to his. And what did he do? Man, let me go ahead and hit this ass. That's he what he He was already did. in there. They were <laughs> naked. Nah, he was already Roxy. in there. Or at least it was rubbing movie. up against it. At least it was rubbing up against movie. it. Nah, they was already half hunching. Nah, man. So she you ain't never been there. rolling around naked and it's touching your genitals and the genitals on it's genitals? Touching your genitals. <laughs> what you is keep going, going on? The worst parts. They're, they're, ruining, they're ruining our childhood, bro. Notice it. Ain't us. Anyway, so that's nasty. Whatever. It ain't us. It is the we ladies. We have respect. <laughs> I said they stayed together, had a kid. She was like, nah. They he wasn't had, in love with each other. What? He had kids with everybody because he's the only. He's the alpha. So there was multiple right. children. If we're gonna stick to by the book what it is in real life standards of lions, yes, he was tagging everything else too. But so we would, wasn't, like, we would like to keep this in this universe, Roxy. So so, <laughs> what it sounds like you're trying to set up is, hey, Mufasa can have Sarabi, but I just need him to come around my cave and tap this ass. That's too. what she wants. That's what it I sounds never said like. That. You're I never exactly, because you didn't mention that. Mufasa doing the same thing. You like Simba out there messing with everybody. I didn't say anything. Yeah, you ought to be. A Mufasa was too, because now was his sister. Hmm. Yes. If, if, if we're only, doing about the thing, yes. Yes, that's his sister. So he's smashing his sister. Y'all all hype over incest. I listen to me. This is not how it happened. <laughs> okay. I was like, because if we get into anything, <clears throat> you talking about fucking. And I, I have, I have, my, <laughs> I, have my, I have my analysis. All right. Yeah. Go for it. Marco. Mufasa and Scar used to run run things. Right. This is not their original pride. But what they did, they took over the pride because you know how the male lion, they fight to get control of the pride. So Mufasa and Scar were like, yo, let's take over, let's take over this pride. So Mufasa, let's say, let's say it was Nala's dad who was over the pride before. So let's say Mufasa and Scar were like, yo, let's, let's, let's go about this action. They fought Nala's dad, killed him. Now, Mufasa gets with Sarabi, who's also part of the Pride. And then they have Simba. Nala's just chilling. She don't know what happened. She don't know what happened to her dad. They go. They're not, they're not brother and sister. Damn, that's what happened. That's how he got the scar. Fuck. That's, that's how he deep. got the scar. That's the hey, that'd be a dope prequel for the Lion I like King. I like it. I'm in. What I'm in. Roxy? What, what, what you trying to do? They would have killed Nala because they wouldn't let the offspring live. Not if it's a, a girl. They don't. They would have took. They still would have killed her because it's the offspring. They don't want her to pre procreate with that lion. If we're going by lion rules, I'm not gonna say nothing else. Though, go ahead. No, all lion rules. rules. We want lion king rules, right? <laughs> no, like what are you? <laughs> so we can be making people crackheads. I'm, I'm trying to. I'm trying to start a conversation. You can make people crackheads, but when I say that they real lion rules, I'm I'm the villain. Well, I'm trying to help you, you out because Mufasa from Sarabi. No, I don't. I don't have to. I just thought a pussy. He, we could share. I don't want him. So hold on. So let me get this right. You mad at me turning this to a crackhead, but what you've just turned Mufasa into is a incest pedophile who killed his parents, and you still want to fuck that. him. So Marco what did that. that make you? I was just going with Alpha Marco said. I didn't say that. But you throw this on him. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm not responsible. 
Didn't Scar get his scar when he was younger, <clears throat> though? Mm-hmm. We don't yeah. know how young they were when they was up in here running the streets, man. <laughs> they putting this on the dead lions, dog, like blue face. <laughs> Put it on the dead Leos, cuz. <laughs> oh my god! Put that on Leo. Okay. Well, man. All right. So, uh, one thing I want to know was since we have some, uh, since we have them up, what do you think, music-wise, these four characters are listening to? Like, what do you think Simba got in his headphones right now, currently? Ooh. I'm just gonna throw out there, based off of how you drew him, he got some hard Justin Bieber in there, and he ain't ashamed of it. <laughs> oh, wow. He's not that- listening to that diary project, which was actually pretty hard. I'm just the, the journal, the journal joint. No. That was that was that was fire. See? Yes. You should go check. That, that was out. fire. Those were dope. Um, I would say he's listening to a lot of Drake, bro. <laughs> diary. Drizzy? Yeah. Got some Drizzy in there, yeah. I see it. Simba's super yeah. emotional. Yeah. I could see it. Yeah. <laughs> Sly, what about you? You've been you've been in and out with this with this Listen. Uh, <laughs> So what who what you think Simba's listening to? Um I feel like if Drake's up there, he probably listens to a lot of Chris Brown and Trey songs too. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'm with that. Marco, what about you, I'm man? What you, what you think? That makes sense. <clears throat> I, I think he throws on some like some Afro beats from time to time. Okay. Next with the culture, yeah, I agree. I'm seeing some Ross in there too, a little Rick Ross with the pants color. I feel like he'd be in Miami with Rick Ross, Rick Ross a couple of times, just chilling. <laughs> yeah, he can hang. He, he could definitely hang. Yeah, Cleo. He what could about you? Hang with Rick Ross. As far as uh, I, I picked Drake. I think he definitely. Oh yeah, yeah. That's right. Well, uh, Roxy, did you pick? No, I was just looking at them sexually still. Um, I agree with what everything y'all said. He's staring at Mufasa uh, and there's no print I, there. I got a little high before this, I'm sorry. <laughs> you need to get the no. fan again? Wait, no. <laughs> you are on punishment. I ain't got time for this. I ain't got time for this. I don't want they, you're, grounded. Fact, they, you're grounded. <laughs> they gonna take all the monetization off because uh Disney gonna respond. We do not appreciate you. <laughs> Allow this woman to I fuck our characters. That's not what they were built for. Well, they say that. Meanwhile, you give us certain moments within your films that we'd be like, mm. <laughs> That's true. Pull that picture up again, you had Cleo. We'll go ahead and pull that picture back up. <laughs> she said, Let me come back. Wait, Roxy, back can play, man. I hate that zoo make you ask to unmute them and you can't. Yeah, don't be them. making me leave. I hate when it don't just let you do it. Yeah, could you be looking at these like? I won't look at his penis anymore, fine. We all knew what this meant. She was they getting beaded like I said. Them's was the bedroom eyes, them's that. Can you feel the love tonight? Speaking of the love, I am quite positive. Beyonce was coming out. I took that clip and I put uh, Beyonce's let me sit this ass on you on top I of that. I remember video. that. Bro, the it, bro. <laughs> I remember Instagram that. lost it, Twitter lost it. Yo, I got this exclusive clip. I remember you. that. You should like it. <laughs> this ass on you. That shit there, bro. I think when you posted that, I messaged Kadeem. I was like, take his phone. Bro, <laughs> it's been several moments, man. You don't want to sexualize the characters, but and we're not trying to. We're just having an open conversation about what could potentially be, you know, a continued story. <laughs> They had kids, so they obviously had to have intercourse. Bingo. Someone yeah. had to explain that to the kiddies. I don't know what Nala's listening to, but if it's Janae. Beyonce. Or yeah. it's Janae. Janae. She used to be on set. She's in her face. She listening to the first one. Mm-hmm. She listening to her. It's definitely Janae. Listen to her, yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. What's I ain't gonna lie. I think, I, I think uh, Simba and, no, 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 uh, Mufasa and Sarabi, it, Sarabi getting her back broken off to some Drew Hill. Come on, too. man. That's what Mufasa is. Tell me what you off. want. Uh, the skill. You see, you see how she gets the hips? They just come in with he that is, bass. She is man thick, though. She's in my bedroom. There you go. 
Go ahead, girl. I want to fuck you on the top of that rock where we held hey. somebody. Hey. Can y'all stop That's doing this? That's inappropriate. Have some coops. Cool. I could hear some cool. genuine on that. This is, yep, it's a good <laughs> <old genuine. laughs> 